Filmora recently released a beta version of what they're calling template mode. And I'm here to tell you, it's a game changer. It's their first step towards what I call drop and click, as the templates have predefined music, transitions, and even titles. And all you have to do is simply import your videos and photos, and voila, auto magically your video is created in less than 60 seconds. And in most time, even less than 30 seconds. If you don't believe me, well stick around because in today's video, I'm gonna demonstrate Filmora's template mode and show you just how easy content creation is getting ready to become. Typically, we would skip over the installation process, but at the time of this recording, the process isn't that straightforward, so I definitely wanna walk you through it just in case you get stuck. If you keep this box checked here, this is typically the screen that appears when Filmora X is started. Once template mode has been downloaded and installed on your system, this is what the new screen will look like. To download Filmora template, you'll first need to find the exact version of Filmora X, which is located at the URL that you see here on your screen, and I'll also link to it in the description down below. So simply click on the download button and the software begins downloading. Likewise, double click the executable once the file is finished downloading and then click install to begin the installation. Once that's done, you can now download the beta version of template mode by clicking download as you see here. And once that's been completed, you're now presented with an introductory screen that previews the templates available and you're all set to go. We're just gonna go ahead and pick this one and so let's go ahead and jump right in. So the question still remains, how long will this take to create a video? We're actually gonna do this in just a few seconds without using any speed ramps. So let's go into this folder, select all the sample video files and click open. We'll start the timer after we hit auto create here and there we go. So while we're waiting for this video file to complete, let me just share with you I'm actually processing this right now using an HP Envy X360 Windows computer with an Intel Core i7 processor and 16 gigs of RAM. But once we're done here shortly, the video is going to automatically play. So now that you see how easy it is to let Filmora do his thing, let's go ahead and edit a few of those titles that you saw there playing. And we're gonna go ahead and use a speed ramp to get through this a little quicker. We'll keep the default parameters, but you actually have the options to change the font, size, and color of any of the text that you see here, if you so desire. Another customizable option is the ability to apply filters to the video. Let's find a section of the video to demonstrate this. And so here you see how it looks to apply different filters to this section of the video here. The video length has a few options grayed out here in this template, but notice the video length can be changed, but with this template and these files selected, it's grayed out here. But notice that music is enabled by default, but by unchecking this box here, you can disable it if you so choose. Additionally, you can trim or change the music. And here we see Filmora provides tons of options for you to choose from. And they also give you the option of adding your own music by importing the audio file. The trim selection allows you to pick a section of the song you like based on the length of the video. Let's go ahead and quickly export the file by giving it a name, keeping the same aspect ratio of 1920 by 1080. The beta version doesn't have an option to render the file for smooth playback at the moment. So we'll demonstrate the video quality here at the end. But before we do that, you may be wondering, what if I wanna change the template after seeing the one that was auto magically created? But let's preview this one to get a quick glance at how it looks. To 
To preview it with our clips, simply click on use this template and notice you're asked if you want to save your current video. We'll select no since we've already exported it and voila, here goes our new video using the new template. In just five minutes, we unpacked quite a lot today. And as you can see, there's so much potential with this new feature, the beta version of template mode that Filmora is bringing. Let me know what you thought of today's video down in the comments. And let me know if you can see yourself using this feature. And if you consider purchasing Filmora X, then be sure to click on that link in the description. I want to thank each and every one of you again for always rocking in here with me. And until next time, stay safe, take care of yourselves, and peace.